Hi guys, my name is Ruben Alves, I'm from Robot Ignite Academy and today we are going to see how to solve this problem, retrieve the robot name. The user asks, is there a way to retrieve the robot name from the URDF in C++ or any other way to get it? Thanks. Ok, in order to solve this, we are going to use Robot Ignite Academy. Let me launch a course here. When you launch a course in Robot Ignite Academy, you already have all the ROS environment run, so it's easier for us. In this tutorial, we don't need to follow this tutorial, so let me close here the instructions to get a bigger screen. Okay, now we have a bigger screen. In order, in also in order to solve this, we also are going to follow this URDF tutorials. If you come here to wiki dot roy dot org slash urdf slash tutorials at the end of this page we have this parse a urdf file let's click here and follow the instructions here here we have uh, how to read the urdf file okay this is the important part let's create our cat workspace source in rd in robot ignite academy you already have this source if you come here cat workspace source you already have is is this source folder here and uh, okay, let's create a package called testbot description that depends on the URDF package. Let's just okay, package created. It should be listed here on the left side. Let me okay, it's here. And uh, cd testbot paste cd testbot. Ok, here it says, let's create a URDF folder. In this tutorial, to make it easier, we are not going to follow to create this URDF file because we we, we use a URDF file that already exists in the ROS installation. So, let's go directly to this part. Um, this one here. Create a source folder on the package and create a file called, called parsercpp. This is the code. Let's click here toggle line numbers. So we have the code clean here. And here let's create the folder and source. Mm, here we have the source and create the file called the parser cpp. Okay. Mm, parser twice two files. Okay, here we have the file. Let's just paste this code, copy, paste. Okay, here we have the code. If we check this code, what it does is basically try to read and uh, parse a URDF file he with this code, especially model init file URDF file. If the file is successfully loaded, then a successful message is shown. Let's try to compile this package to compile. It. Oh, but first let's add these two lines to our catkin to our CMake list. Just copy here, copy, and on our CMake list that is generated when you create a package with this catkin create package. Let's copy here anywhere. Just mm, we already have, we already have here an instruction called uh, call it add executable. Let's just paste it here. Paste. OK. Save. Now let's just enter to our Catkin workspace and compile our package with Catkin Make. So let's cd Catkin workspace and Catkin Make to compile our package. OK, let's wait until it compiles. It's compiling. In the meantime, let's go to the insta opt ros indigo. Let's f let's see if we can find any URDF file here. Let's just find any file named URDF that ends with URDF. Okay, we have already have some of them. Mm, ok, 
okay okay it's compiled 100 percent perfect let's now try to call our node it's called parser as we can see here on the CMake list we have added here the instructions mm, to add an executable called parser so let's just rush run our node our package is called testbot so testbot mm, okay my package is not listed here yet so let's host back profile just to make sure our package is now host run testbot okay our file is named parser and the, let's try to open this file it's opt ros indigo and this address let's copy here copy okay opt ros indigo and paste paste okay successful parser urdf file now you want to know the name of the robot on this urdf for that we can just if we see here this is the we 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 have here the get name function in the urdf model so we can just call this get name here for example successful parsed so let's just copy it here copy and paste on the line below with the name of the robot for example and the robot name is and let's show here the robot name for that let's just use this model get name and convert to a sharp pointer okay now let's compile it again cat can make it's compiling okay now let's try to load our parser again and see the name of the robot in this aboard 7 urdf let's run and here we have it the robot name is this let's try to open another urdf let's open this um, let's see fetch let's copy here and let me paste here um, paste okay okay in this case the robot name is fetch that's it guys this is how we can retrieve the robot name from a urdf file you just need to follow this tutorial about how to parse a urdf file and later call this model get name and convert to a, a, a sharp pointer that's it i hope it helps and if you want to receive more videos about ROS, don't forget to subscribe our channel that's it see you guys Thank you.